Hello everybody and welcome to the Grand Floridian Easter Egg Display and the Grand Cottage. I'm Jennifer Caruso and I'm here with my son Nick, Main Street Nick, and we're going to um, get you uh, some good video of the Easter Egg Display, the Grand Cottage, and all the treats here at the Grand Floridian. I hope you all have a very happy Easter. Thank you for watching. Give this video a thumbs up if you like it and leave a comment. Thank you. All right, so we're gonna take a walk down here um, to look at the eggs. You can kind of see the Grand Cottage from up here as well as um, some of the egg displays already. Uh, so let's go down and let's take a look. I think I'll use the stairs. You want to use the elevator, Nick? You can. I'll walk with you. You want to walk with me? Okay. All right. Let's go down the stairs here. This is such a beautiful resort, and always at Christmas and at Easter, um, they have wonderful displays. That if you are uh, in Walt Disney World, join those seasons of the year. I highly recommend that you you know, take the monorail over, come in the Grand Floridian, and check them out. You don't have to be staying here to do that. Okay, let's go in this way, Nick. Here's the front desk where you would check in if you were a guest. And here's the, the lobby with the grand chandelier up there. So pretty. They have a piano player here that plays in the late afternoon. And um, here's our first egg. Oh, wow. There's usually an artist here um, painting. You can see his brushes right here. Um, it's called the Art of Cocoa Butter Painting. And um, later, one of the pastry artists will be here continuing to paint this egg. But let's take a look at what they've done so far. Oh my gosh, Nick, how many of these characters can you name? A there's lot. there's Solly. Wow. There's the turtle. There's everybody uh, on there. Yeah, it's not done though. No, it's not done. There's Woody. Look at everybody. From Cars, Mr. Potato Head. Oh my goodness, Incredibles. Elemental. Yeah, so this is really cool. And now they're going to continue painting. There's um, just some sketches on here. You can kind of see, I see Bo Peep there. I see a lot of, a lot more characters that are going to appear on there. Here they have a really cute little basket of eggs and this table. And they've got some bunnies behind it just to make it look really nice. Let's go over here, Nick, and look at this. Do you recognize that display? Yes, yeah, from Moana. Mm-hmm. All right, here we go. Look at this. This is from um, one of their artists called Fabi, and it says, I've always loved the movie Moana, and on a recent trip to the Polynesian Resort, I saw the angry coconut display and immediately thought that would be a great egg show piece, and it truly is. Look how cute, Nick. Very, very nice. Let me get that all in. There we go. So you can see the whole thing. All right. Continue on down. Oh, look at this. Yay, James and the Giant James Peach. and the Giant Peach. Here we go. Wow, look at that. That's amazing. It's decorated. So cute. Look at that stem. I know, it's very good. All chocolate. Mmm. Only if I can eat it. Only if we could eat it, huh? Mm. And this is done um, by uh, Krista. And she uh, talks about um, how she loved the movies and uh, wanted to bring to life. James and the Giant Peach in the egg display this year. So here we have 
a giant peach. All right, let's take a look here, Nick. Okay, let's see. Now these have two sides to them. So it's interesting. Um, maybe we'll go around. I think this is the front side over here and then there's the back side. Oh, look at that. Look at Alice and look at the clock. It's, yeah, it's actually really nice. working. Give you some detail on this one. Just beautiful. And this is Yachty. She made a Rolex cake once, she said, that had moving hands. And she thought it would be nice to um, make a timepiece in it in Alice in Wonderland. Look at that. And she wanted to make the white rabbit as the focal point on the top because he is the timekeeper. And this is just a pretty egg here. It's very Eastery very nice and this is from Bambi by Meg representative of the movie Bambi this is the baby dragon oh my gosh Nick do you know what movie that's from I'm trying to remember yeah but it's cute. yeah isn't it cute this is by Katie and it's a baby dragon I don't know that it is in any particular like, yeah, movie. Like, she just wanted to make a baby dragon. Maybe it is. I don't know. Look at this. Oh my gosh. This is the Disney Snacks by Stephanie. Look at this egg. It has all the different Disney Snacks in it. Look at the turkey leg. Oh my goodness. Isn't that cute? Would it, who would like that that we know, Nick? Oh, Mr. Dean. Mr. Dean, the turkey legster. Yeah, oh. very cute. Very cute on the Disney Park oh. snack. Let's go around the other side. Let's just go in here and see the backs of these four that we just um, saw right now. Oh, look. In oh, the Alice, cat. they have the Cheshire Cat. Look at that. Look how cute. And there's a clock around the back as well. Oh, there's and, actually Bambi. Yeah, and, <laughs> I was like, and where's here's, Bambi on here's Bambi. This might actually be the front side of the eggs, and that may be the back. I don't know. I, don't, I mean, both sides. No, because look, the dragon is facing out, so the front I, is I, out there. I think the reverse yeah. Both ways, yeah. And here you have all the Disney snacks. Look at that. You have churros, the turkey leg, you have pretzels, you have the Mickey bar. Look at that, very cute. I love how they made this Mickey bar with a bite out of it. It looks great. And some popcorn. It's decorated with popcorn too. Oh, good. Okay, now we've got to get back out here. Let's go look for some more eggs. Rabbit looks nice. Yeah. Aren't those beautiful? Look at those. Just little rabbits. Oh, that's awesome. The Emperor's New Groove one. Look at this from the Emperor's New Groove. Oh my goodness. Do you remember that character's name, Nick? I don't remember him. Yzma as a cat though. Yzma. That's cat bird, isn't it? Oh, okay. That's cute. This is by Chef Allison and it was her favorite movie, The em uh, Emperor's New Groove and Yzma. So, here you have her little um, story here. Love that. I love the hat. Look at how they have the little ball cap on them. Here's Onward. Huh, Nick? This yeah. is awesome. And this is by Juan. Get you a whole picture of this, which is really nice. Oh, elemental. Yep, they that got the, is, they yeah. have the fire and the water. Yeah. And this is by Joanne. And um, here's her little story. I love how the um, fire is sparkly on the edges. I don't know if that's coming through, um, but there, there's glitter. Do you see the glitter on the edges of that, Nick? Oh, uh, yes, I do, really actually. It's really shiny. Yeah. yeah. And this is, um, of course, water. 
All right, let's look up here and see what we have here. Okay. Uh, oh, my munchling. Here's the munchlings. How cute. Look with a little oven, a little um, range there, and some measuring spoons, and they've got Easter eggs over there. Very cute. And this is also by um, Krista, who did this. This is a finished egg here by John. And um, this is another one with all of the characters on it. And it goes the whole way around. Look how cute Mickey looks on that. Yeah, I just like that. Oh my gosh, and there's Jiminy Cricket too. Let me yeah, zoom in so on that a little bit for you. At least this one's done. Yeah, this one's done. I mean, it might be from last year. Do you know that they're displaying it and they kept it? I'm not sure. I don't know. Or they just say. finished it early probably. Or they just finished it, right. Oh, look at this. Elle's Toy, toy Barn. Toy Story. Mm-hmm. Elle's Toy Barn. Very cute on that one. And that's done by Justine. It's the third egg that she's done. Look at that. Oh, my gosh. Look how beautiful this one is. This is done by Yadi. Let me let her come around here. Look, there's Belle from Beauty and the Beast. Isn't that beautiful? And there's the Beast, look, there. And then you've got the inside of the egg, which is um, the Beast's lyre in the west wing with the rose. Oh, look at this. This is from Aladdin. Yeah. Isn't that the Sultan's Palace? Yes, it is. That is so nice. Very pretty. Look at Raja down there in the corner. And you have Jasmine over here. Very nice on that one as well. Very pretty. And this is done by Monica. She, she loves Aladdin and knew she wanted to create something um, from Aladdin. Get her little story in here. All right. Oh, look at this, Nick. This yeah. is from the Main Street Electrical Parade. Yeah. Isn't that cute? It is. Actually, it's really creative. Very creative. Very, very nice. Now, um, how do we get in to see the backs of these? Or um, uh, maybe well, we can. Uh, those ones don't really have backs. They don't have no, backs, so except have for the rows. And they have that turning. Yeah, it spins. So. Yeah, it spins. Okay, so no backs on these. So we're good there. Yeah. Look at this. It's a Disney it's villain a, eggs. It's by Trisha, and these eggs are of different villains. Well, there's Scar. Lotso up there. Lotso. Queen of Hearts and Ursula. There's Ursula. See, that's where she's holding um, the voice mm -hmm. of the Little Mermaid and the Queen of Hearts. So there you go. You've got four villain eggs. Here's Meg. And Meg made this beautiful egg, Snow White. Look at that. And I, I love how she has um, the different uh, ideas of how you draw, you know, like, like this, showing you, you know, how she would maybe um, start out with a drawing for that. Very nice. And it says, I pulled inspiration from distant, different stages of animation, including character model sheets, background design, and pencil tests, all on that egg. That's kind of creative. This egg kind of has a back to it. Um, you really, you can't see yeah, the back to it. Yeah, Cinderella's on the back. Mom, yeah. Oh, Cinderella is on the back. We can see the back. Just a second. We'll go over and see the back. And here's Aurora. Um, this is a giant koi pond. Um, from um, Aurora is the um, artist that designed this and she said she had a pond in her backyard as a young child like I usually think of koi orange I don't know why no, I, I, there's I, white I mean, that's ones how you too see them, but there's yeah. Different colors, yeah that's pretty okay different more bunnies yeah some more bunnies and let's get happy see. bunny oh very cute Let's see if we can see the back of this egg. I, we can. Here we go with Cinderella. Just beautiful. Ask your mom here, come over here. See a war at this one. Yeah. 
And you kind of can see the backs of these displays here. Um, like the Salton Palace looks really cool. It's designed the whole way around. Very nice. All right. I usually never get to see the eggs. It seems like the eggs this year are mainly centered here around the cottage. Um, I don't know, for some reason, like I thought there were more eggs over there uh, in smell. previous years. Um, here, this one is done by uh, Carolina and Monica, and it's Daisy Dock House. And there's their little information there. Um, but look how beautiful that is. Look at the detail on this. Yeah, it is. I mean, this is beautiful. But these flowers, these little tiny flowers are amazing. The roof looks really cool too, but that wouldn't be as hard to do as these little flowers. I think, I think that um, that is the most difficult thing on here. And look at the tiny rabbits. Look how difficult that must have been too. And I love how they did the grass. Look at the icing that makes up the grass, Nick. It, know, it, really, looks, it really looks like grass, all individual strands. Yeah, which is, oh my gosh, they must have had a very thin um, pastry yeah. or something. Yeah. bag for that. Uh huh. Mm. And this is Princess and the Frog. Look at that. And that is done by Maria here, um, who did Princess and the Frog. And... Uh, she was so inspired by that movie when she saw it that she wanted to do Tiana. And inside here, you can see um, you can see Tiana right there. Very pretty. This one is done by Mary Rose, and it's Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway. I love the lights on that, Nick. Do you Thank like you that one? Very That's bright. the old Chinese theater in yeah, Hollywood I mean, so Studios where, um, where they have Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway now. Very, very nice on that. Not as much detail on that. I mean, the thing is making that light up, I think, is the hard part. The roof has a good bit of detail. Oh, look at the sword and stone. That is really The great. sword and the stone. That's beautiful. Wow. That's a lot of uh, cocoa butter painting, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Look at that. There's Merlin. And they have a nice little plaque on that. Look at yes, that. Yeah, with a description on it. Yeah, with a description. And that's done by Juan. He loved the sword and the stone as a kid. His favorite quote was, train your brain and not your muscles. We got to tell Mike that, huh, Nick? Yeah. <laughs> that's my other son, Mike. Mike is not... Um, not a, a huge, huge Disney fan like my Nick is, although he'll come to the parks. Uh, it's my Nick who just really enjoys Disney. So let's look here at um, oh, the back oh, of this. They even have the wizard duel on the other side. Oh That's my so goodness. That's so cool with all the, like, the, all Show the me, and stuff they turn into. Oh yeah, look at, look at the other side of the sword and the stone. Very awesome. That is a, that egg had to take many many hours to do. What do you think? Oh well, I'm gonna say probably five days, maybe. Three maybe weeks. longer. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, look here. They even have the little oh, picnic the blanket picnic and the fireworks in the sky um, from Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway. Oh yes, and the words here: "Nothing can stop us now." How cute! Love it with a picnic basket. There's Pluto. And look who's up there, Nick. Can you see? Right there. On the tree. Oh, the bird. Oh, oh I yeah. see a bird. I'm like, am I looking at something? Like, yeah. yeah. But that bird has a name. It does? I'm pretty sure. I forget. Well, it will come to me. All right, here we go. Tiana on the back. Yeah, here's Tiana on her egg. We saw the front of that where she was kind of sculptured out inside of the egg. All right. Next, we have um, the Grand Cottage here. And let's go take a look at the menu. It is really cute. This is up every Easter. It's in the same place as the Gingerbread House in the lobby of the Grand Floridian. And um, let's see what they have here. We'll look at the menu. 
Oh, oh, look at this one. They have a display of the menu. Yeah, they have a display of the menu too, which we'll look at of the actual treats. It's open daily from uh, 9 to 9. I love the hot cross buns, number two on the list. Are we going to get one? I think we'll get one, Nick. Right, if you want. Yeah. Okay. And there are all the treats you can get. There's the grand egg for $20. Paint oh. your own chocolate egg for a $25. How about that? You can that for five bucks more. You can if you want to paint your own egg. Everybody wants to paint their own egg. <laughs> Oh, All right, this, this here we go. And look, this is the Easter tree box. Look at that, where you get that. The big, I didn't see that on the menu, did you? Huh. It's $80 for the Easter tree box right there. And it looks like it has um, some cookies in it. It has some different chocolates. It has a big rabbit in it. Here's what the Easter a marshmallow pop looks like here. Um, here is the frosty, the fruity cereal Mickey pop here. The cream cheese carrot coffee cake here. Here's the hot cross bun. It's delicious. Would you share that with me, Nick? Well, which one? The hot cross bun. Yeah. No, nah, too many carbs. Here's the <laughs> carrot blondie pop. Um, the, the lemon blueberry whoopie pie. Look at that. Whoopie. Mm. They have a milk chocolate bunny for $12. I know you like white chocolate, I Nick. I do. Um, paint your own chocolate egg, and that looks like it's white chocolate. Oh, egg. I thought it would actually be circular. Like, I don't think I'd well, buy it. Well, it's that an now. egg with a rabbit. You know, it's yeah, but a, I thought it would be circular. Yeah. Like an egg egg. Um, there's the um, bunny pop flower pot. I don't know what happened to the marshmallow egg. I ate it. Um, you, <laughs> there's the grand egg. Look right there. Yeah, no, that's actually worth I, that's, bucks. I think that's filled with something i want to ask look at this confetti pop look at the little shape how cute and oh look nick if you just want um white chocolate there's a white chocolate bunny pop Ooh, i can even eat his hat yeah you could and there's the macarons and those are the treats that we have here you can see in here um that the hot cross buns and the guava sweet treat uh the guava cream cheese sweet roll Ooh. is available only till five. And look, they have them in there here warming. They look Ooh. so good. Yummy. Yeah. All right. So they have more display. Yeah, here's all the treats here. Different oh, color the eggs. egg comes in different colors. White chocolate with jelly beans. Inside. White chocolate with jelly bean and the blue one is dark uh, milk cho chocolate. They're all white chocolate. They're just the pink and blue. And That's the only the milk chocolate. And, and you have no dark chocolate. I'm all, all out of dark. Well, this is dark chocolate. With jelly beans. Okay. And then it has dark chocolate milk and white. Oh, that's nice. Chocolate. The pot is dark chocolate. That's my favorite dark chocolate. That is really nice. And this is that the is a car coffee carrot cake. Coffee carrot cake. I didn't see that on the menu. And then this is a carrot cake with white chocolate. Carrot already. carrot cake with white chocolate. And so even though this egg is a different color it's than this one, it's chocolate. still white chocolate the with jelly the jelly beans inside. Green, yellow, and pink. Okay, and is this the marshmallow? Yeah, that, that is one. Um, dark chocolate with marshmallow fluff. And okay. Then this is our marshmallow pop. This is dark chocolate. So here's another dark yeah. chocolate option with marshmallow pop. And this is just a cupcake, which is cute too. That is like a dirt cup. So it has a dirt a, cup. Oh, okay. So it's chocolate um, cake with pudding and ganache. Mm. Pudding and ganache and, then and this cake. Is our confetti pop. Yeah. So it's like a birthday confetti cake, but it's a confetti pop. Okay, a confetti pop, but like a birthday cake. All right, what are you gonna have? I'll treat you. Um, I'm gonna wait for the contemporary. Oh no! Okay, <laughs> well, to, I'm gonna get a hot cross bun. Really well, we it. can't yet. We'll have to come back because it will melt. Okay. All right, so here's the hot cross bun. It looks really good. It looks like there's little raisins on it. And um, you can see it has some icing on the top.
delicious. One to ten, how would you rate that? One to ten, this is definitely a nine. A nine? A nine. Mmm. Very, very good. Now, is it very sweet? No. Really? It is not really sweet. It has just the right amount of sweetness, and it is like buttery, and they did give me some extra butter if I want it, which I may use. Yeah, because that's the reason I didn't want it, because I thought it would be too sweet. No, it's not sweet. I'm going to let you taste it, okay? Okay. All right. Thanks. Hi, I'm Jennifer Caruso. If you've enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. Leave me a comment. If you're new to my channel, subscribe. Ring that notification bell, select all, and you'll be notified when I post new content or go live from the Disney parks. I also live stream and vlog cruising and travel and adventure in the South Florida area. I hope to see you back on my channel. Thank you for watching.